welcome back to my channel. Today is Christmas Day, December 25th, and this is my What I Got for Christmas. This is probably my favorite video out of the year that everybody filmed, so I wanted to hop on the trend since I just started my YouTube channel a couple months ago. I am so excited to film this video. Also, I think that this will be really cool to look back on, like what I was interested in at the time and all that kind of stuff. I'm gonna do the basic disclaimer. This is not a chance for me to brag. I'm not trying to show off or anything like that. I am so grateful that I got all of this stuff. I know that like I would be happy with half, a quarter, a sixth of all this stuff. I just, Christmas is my favorite time of year, first of all. I love giving gifts. I love seeing people open their gifts. That's probably one of my favorite things is seeing people open gifts, even if it's not from me. Um, and obviously I love opening gifts too, but the traditions that me and my family have in decorating and all this kind of stuff, is what Christmas is all about to me personally. I'm super grateful and I'm not trying to brag, so we're gonna not talk about that anymore. And if you guys don't like these videos, I don't know why you watch them. There will be a couple of clips, um, one clip in a different location because tomorrow we are starting our drive to Michigan and we will be staying at my aunt and uncle's house for a couple days and then we will exchange presents there tomorrow on the 26th. So I will bring all my filming equipment and film up there what they give me so there might be like a little section in the middle of this video that is not in this setup but let's get on in to what I got for Christmas okay so first I think I'm gonna start out with what my friends got me for Christmas um, friends giving gifts is always the hardest thing because I always feel like if someone gives me a gift I have to give them a gift um, which I normally try but with COVID and everything I didn't really exchange gifts with many people so it made my life a lot easier. So this gift is from my friend Caroline. Um, if you guys watched my day in my life you guys will know who she is. A group of like the four of us did a secret Santa and she got me. So the big like main gift I guess you could say was this Among Us Cyan plushie. I know that like this is kind of a weird gift to some people but we have a really big inside joke when it comes to Among Us and I know a lot of people play it but in our friend group it's kind of like a sacred thing can't really see it but um yes and I absolutely love it I think that that is such a fun keepsake to have like to remember this time of our friendship and all that next she got me the Tombow Fudenosuke brush pens that I asked for in my video she watched my Christmas list wish list video and um, she got these for me these are great pens um, for bullet journaling, if you guys are getting into that and you guys are getting into calligraphy, these are great. They're like six bucks for this two pack. There's a hard tip and a soft tip. They're great. Definitely recommend it. So the next part of this gift is so cute to me. You guys know I'm obsessed with Harry Potter. There will be a lot of Harry Potter themed things in this video. But she painted me this. You guys, can you see that? It's a little canvas and it's platform nine and three quarters. And then there's the little snitch right there because Quidditch is my favorite thing in Harry Potter like ever and then she painted my name in like the little Harry Potter writing I thought that was such a cute little thing and I can put it up on my shelf where I put all my Harry Potter stuff and then she got this little stand um it's like gold and so it can just like sit up there which I think is so cute and she was like this costed no money a lot of this stuff like she was like yeah, I tried to do stuff that wouldn't cost money so I could get you more things, which I thought was really cute. So the next thing she got me is a photo frame with this picture of us in it. The glare from my window. I don't know if you guys can see, but um, yeah, we really didn't really have that many pictures together. And then one day it was my friend's birthday and we were like, we have to take pictures because we have no pictures together. But... She printed me out three other pictures, so she printed me out another one of us, which is, this is my favorite picture of us. It's like her fixing her hair. It's, to me, the funniest thing. And then this is the four of us. She printed out two pictures of the four of us. This picture is in my thumbnail for the day of my life video. And then lastly, she just wrote me this really cute card. You guys, look at the back. Like, she put effort into this gift. I mean, I got her, so I also put effort into her gift, but... Um, it's a Disney card and then she like really decked it out and I love cards. They are some of my favorite things I know a lot of people say that but I have always loved cards So you people who just started loving cards, I've always loved them. I save every card I get um, So I love cards. So if you guys know me and you want to get me a card I will save it because I love cards. So thank you Caroline so much for that gift I really do appreciate it. So yeah, I love you and I hope you had a Merry Christmas um, the next friend I'm going to talk about is my friend Caitlin. 
Um, I have known her since I was like two. She's my best friend. Like, she's that type of friend where I, we won't talk for like three years and then we'll be like, which we talk all the time. But it's like that type of friend where you won't talk for three years and then you get together and it's like nothing, like nothing's changed. So she got me this um, best of skincare little advent calendar thing. So it's like this, I already opened them all. But it has like a mini loofah, some eye patches, some different bath bombs, face masks, all that type of stuff, which I love that stuff. This is kind of like the only makeup-y gift I got this year. I didn't really ask for very much makeup because there wasn't many releases that I like was interested in this year. And then um, she got me this little uh, ornament, which is so cute. It's like a little paper cup with hot chocolate and like literally hot chocolate mix in it. Um, which I will have to take that out before we put away the Christmas decorations, but um, I love a good ornament um, Love it. And then my friend Sophia we all exchange she's like um, I've known her since elementary school and uh, me her and Caitlin all exchanged gifts um, like together first off she got me and Caitlin each like a sweatshirt that was kind of like our personalities and I absolutely love mine this is um, from Target it's just this um, purple tie-dye and I have no purple sweatshirts and then it has this like rose design with something in French on the top I've already worn it and I love it it is so comfy and I absolutely love that and then she got uh, me her and Caitlin matching necklaces you guys this is the absolute cutest thing I don't know if you guys can um, it's little three little birds on a perch that's literally me, her, and Caitlin. Like, it's the, f I, I love it. And I asked for a ton of silver necklaces this year because I don't have any. So that was very perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Sophia and Caitlin. I love you so much. And I hope you had a Merry Christmas. I'm going to do a quick, like, family friend thing. Um, she's my, my mom's best friend. So she gave me a little gift. I have an HP sprocket. So she just gave me some more paper for it because I do, um, like, monthly photos. So... Um, definitely will use that and then she it also came with like these little um, like plastic photo frames which are so cute and they're like pastel colors I've never seen anything like that before and then um, it came with this like little kit to with clothespins and like twine to make like a almost like a Polaroid garland but it has just like these borders with pastel colors which I thought that was so cute and I don't know where in my room I will put that but I will do it and put it somewhere thank you so much Beth and the I don't want to say your last name and your family you probably don't watch my videos but I love you this is from another family friend it's actually from my sister's godmother she's a family friend so first off I always ask for I feel like at least one party game or game um for christmas and i saw this one at target a couple months ago it's called hot words kind of reminds me of taboo if you guys ever played that game and i'm super excited to um do it um it's basically like you have to describe something without saying specific words it looks really fun so i'm very excited to try and that out and i'll let you guys know if it's a good game and then i got this baby it is the fluffiest puffball on the top it is this like light blue color which i think will look super cool with my hair and for michigan this will be great because i don't have any like good hats so i am very excited to use that thank you so much carrie i love you and i miss you okay so this clip is in the middle of this video but it is two or three hours later because we just did a zoom session opening presents from my aunt and uncle on my mom's side so this is what they got me so i asked for these pants I, my air conditioning just came on. I asked for these pants and I really hope that they look good on me because any pants like this like don't normally look good on me, but they are these two-toned pants and they're like straight legs. Mom jeans don't look good on me. These are really cute and I really hope that they fit me. And then I got $100, so thank you so much to my aunt and uncle. Um, my mom said I don't want to say names, but I love you guys so much. Sorry for the quick intermission. I'm currently at my aunt and uncle's house. It is the 27th of December right now, and we opened presents last night, so I'm going to show you guys what they got to me. Sorry if you hear any background noise. There is currently eight people in this house, and I am trying to make sure that 
there is no noise but I can't control that so let's just jump right in so first I'm going to start out with stocking stuffers so the first stocking stuffer they opened are these spatulas and I actually me and my sister love to bake but they are Harry Potter Quidditch spatulas so this one says Quidditch Hogwarts and then this one has the snitch and then this one just says quidditch and on the back they all have like the golden snitch so i thought that these were so cute more harry potter stuff and these are from williams sonoma if you guys want to get them and they have gold handles they feel like really nice spatulas so i'm very excited to use these and then the next stocking stuffer i got this is from bite beauty they always do a little set like gift set like this this is the Bite Beauty Sweet Treats Holiday Hangover Agave Lip Care Set. You get a little sample of their agave lip scrub, and then you get a little thing, two of their agave lip mask. And this is in lavender, I think. And then you get a little mini one of their agave lip um, balm, which this lip balm is so great. <laughs> um, I love that lip balm and I have the lip mask at my house so I'm actually really excited to use this because we are um, gonna be in cold weather and skiing and stuff so this will actually be really nice for my lips and then along with that in my stocking I got a $30 Ulta gift card and I am so excited um, I'm gonna get some new makeup and I'm very excited about it so the first gift I got two packs of the Tombow Fudenosuke brush pens. You guys know Caroline also got me a pack of these. So I am stocked up on these, you guys. I have so many and I will never run out. These are the best calligraphy pens, as I said, and they're amazing. The next gift that I opened, which I'm actually using right now, was this tripod. The box is pretty beat up but I love it. It is really, really nice. Um, it goes up to a, it's a six, up to a 60 inch tripod, which is amazing. I'm using it right now and it's super nice. There's a leveler on the side to make sure your camera's level. Um, it's pretty easy to use and I absolutely love it. It also comes with a case to put it in. I'm so excited to use this tripod more, you guys. I absolutely love it. Like looking at this right now, it is amazing. So I love that. So the next thing I got was this little sloth. This is a warmy and it, I'm sorry if you can hear background noise, but it's like a little heating pad. It's a sloth and I absolutely love that. And then I got a pair of Converse. I asked for, an, I got another pair from Sansa. These are adorable, you guys. They are much cuter in person than they were on their website. Um, they look like this. <laughs> they are clear at the bottom. They have like a clear sole and also the logo is clear i don't know if you guys can tell and then the shoelaces say converse all over them i'm so excited to wear these these and my other converse are going to be like my new shoe wear all the time and then the last gift is actually from my godfather who is my uncle he got me a victoria's secret pajama set and i wore it last night and i absolutely love it so it comes with this shirt it's white the window is like but it says love on it it is super comfy and then the pants are amazing they are the they have stars all over them and they're like long pants i love pajamas like this these are so silky and so comfy so i love these thank you so much to my aunt and uncle i love all of this stuff let's just continue on with the rest of the video let's do my grandparents before we get into like the immediate family i mean they are in my immediate family like, but like my sister and Stuff like that. We always do two little stocking stuffers each for each person. So um, first off is this Brandy necklace. I It's in my wish list video. I definitely did ask for it. Um, it is like this chain, just like a dainty silver chain. Um, I just wanted it to layer with silver necklaces because I've really been getting into like silver. Um, so thank you. If you guys want some really good quality, like affordable jewelry, Brandy has some of the best jewelry i didn't want to put up there and my next stocking stuffer i asked for this in my wish list video but i don't think i found a picture of it but it's a dumpling airpod case you guys look at how cute this is it's actually like pretty big i know my airpods are so dirty but this is like all silicone around here um it's a pretty like sturdy airpod case i think it is so cute it is like i love japanese stuff like this this is i've been using it the past couple of days and i absolutely love it so now we're going into like the 
I would say regular gifts, but everything to me is a regular gift. I appreciate everything. So let's just start out with the clothing items. So first, they got me this crew neck. It is a Hogwarts crew neck. I told you there would be some Harry Potter stuff, and this is not the end of it, let me tell you. Um, it's really cute. I love navy. It's one of my favorite colors, and it just has the Hogwarts crest on it. Um, it's a crew neck. I love crew necks. I will definitely be wearing that all the time. And then this was also in my, that was in my wish list video, but I didn't put a picture of that specific one up there. Um, this one was also in my wish list. It is this flannel from American Eagle, and it's like a flannel, and it has like a hoodie, like a Sherpa um, on the inside, like hoodie on the top, I guess, like attached to it, and there's strings and everything. I just thought it was super cute, kind of has like, almost like a light jacket is what I was wanting to use it for. Next is this phone case. I asked for this phone case, and I love it so much. Guys, it's a ketchup packet with my name on it. It is the most adorable thing ever. I also think that it's like super padded because this is actually like puffy. I don't know if you guys can like tell, but it's like squishy. And this is like super um, protective. I guess what you could say, it's a case to case. I just thought this like was so funny and cute to me. So this, these are the Archer. I got asked for a lot of Archer and all of this stuff because I, I'm obsessed with them and their aesthetic or this company. So this is the Archer and Olive Ar Acrylograph, and that's how you say it. Um, this is their paint markers that they came out with a couple months ago. And this is in the Warm Fall selection, and this is the three millimeter tip set. Um, each color selection comes in three millimeter and seven, 0 0.7 millimeter. So this is what they come like, super cute. Every set comes with a white marker. This is what they look like. Um, I am very excited. I'm very excited to play with these colors. I told my mom that I, when I, as soon as I opened them, I was like, um, for my birthday, I'm asking for every single other color because I already know I'm going to be obsessed with them. So, yes, I, if you guys want me to like talk about them at all, I will, but I love that. And then the last thing that they did, which is probably my favorite gift, to be honest, from them, this is... They are going to give a $100 donation to a charity of m me and my sister's choice. So we each get $100 um, to give to a charity um, of our choice in our name, which I thought was really, really sweet. Um, I haven't done any research. I'm good. I'm going to research. I'm not just going to give to a charity um, that I like, don't know about. I'm definitely going to research and make sure that it goes to a good cause. Okay, so now um, we're going to do like the family that lives in my house. But we're going to do some Santa gifts. Let's do it. First thing in my stocking was the super cute beanie. I got two beanies, which is kind of funny. I actually am looking at another beanie, so I think that that's why this got in my stocking because I was I've been talking about it so much. But it's this maroon beanie, my favorite color. Um, it's super nice. My sister has a black one, and she's been literally wearing it all day, and it looks super nice. So I think that this is going to be like my everyday beanie in Michigan, and I'm very excited. Again, maroon's my favorite color, so I was very excited when I saw that. This is like, I feel like me and my sister each get a candy in our stockings every year. And this year, you guys, if you guys have never had Sweet Tarts Chews, they are my favorite candy. They're like a Laffy Taffy, but they're flavored like Sweet Tarts. They are amazing. And you used to be able to get them at Dollar Tree, but now you can't find them anywhere. And the only time I get them is Halloween because they're in like the big candy packs. But my, in my stocking, I got two packs of sweetheart shoes they are amazing and i have no idea where santa found these um i already opened it and started eating one because they are literally my favorite these will probably be gone in a week or so because i love them so much okay so actually every single member of my family got socks like these these are called bombas um and they go to like a charity so i got a pair of bombas they are socks and pretty snazzy socks um, if I do say so myself. I don't really have much to say about them, their socks. I will wear them. <laughs> um, a bullet journal item. These are four of these sets of washi tapes from Amanda H. Lee's merch. You guys, there are four washi tape sets. I asked for the, I don't remember. Um, if you guys wanna know exactly which sets these are, go to my holiday wish list video. Um, it'll be linked in an iCard and then it'll also be um, at the end of, at the end of this video, um, but 
I got four sets and I'm very excited to use these. I am mainly excited for the plaid or like the grid ones because I've been trying to find washi tapes like that everywhere and I'm so excited, so. And also I love um, my Dr. Lee, so. I feel like in my stocking every year, Pura Vita is something that always shows up. Um, so I got this pack. This is the Anxiety Disorder Awareness Pack. Uh, I struggle with anxiety. We're not gonna get into that, but I thought I actually really like these bracelets. I don't have any like this one with a gem, so those are really cute. And then I got this one, which is for Save the Sea Turtles, which these both go to charity. Like 5% of the proceeds go to charity um, from both of these bracelets. But it's like this light pink color with like a little um, rose gold sea turtle. And then I don't know, this was, it's probably like a surprise bracelet or something. Oh, it's an anklet! Oh, I didn't even know that until right now. That is so cute. I have another anklet from Pure Vita, and I will wear it in the summer all the time. So it's like a braided anklet. I didn't even know it was an anklet. Then I have two Harry Potter themed things. First is, this is a Harry Potter game. This is the Harry Potter Who Is It card game. And it's kind of like if you've ever played Guess Who, I think is what the game is called. I'm not exactly sure, but um, it is very similar to that. And I already played it and I already love it because I love Harry Potter. And then I got some Harry Potter socks. Um, I'm really excited about these actually. Um, <laughs> I am such a nerd, but there's Deathly Hollows, Expecto Patronum, Mischief Managed, Platform Nine and Three Quarters, and then I solemnly swear I'm up to no good. And if you guys, probably if you guys don't know anything about Harry Potter, you won't know what any of that means. But I love those. So that is everything in my stocking. Stocking stuffers, I think I've said it on this channel, are one of my favorite things in the world, and I love them. Okay, so then I got two other gifts from Santa. First gift is this, you guys. I saw this at Target, and I forgot to put it in my wish list video. These are called Disney Cuddles, I think, and they're like, look at it's Stitch, and he's sleeping. I, he's the softest thing ever. I always get a stuffed animal for Christmas. I love stuffed animals. It is so cute, and it's sleeping, and it's like the perfect, like, hugging position. I literally, I've been talking about that gift probably the most because I've been wanting it for months, and I'm so glad I got it. And then I got a pair of shoes. I asked for two pairs of Converse this year. I'm actually really glad I got these um, because these were the ones I wanted like the most out of the two pairs that I asked for. They're the neutral color blocking Converse. Uh, they're the Chuck Taylors and they're like leather. Um, I, I think they're faux leather, but they're like neutral color blocking and I love them. Um, I only really have white high top Converse and I do really like high top Converse. They're some of my favorite shoes. So now, before we get into my parents, we are going to do my sister. This was in the thumbnail. I cried when I got this gift. Like, I'm not even joking, I cried. Um, and it's this. I don't even know if you guys can see it. It's a suitcase, and it's a Hogwarts suitcase. And it has, it says the Hogwarts Express. It has Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, Slytherin, and Gryffindor, and then the Huffle, I mean, the Hogwarts Crest. And I've also wanted a suitcase like this for a really long time, and I also will know it's mine. And also, the back is blank, so I think that this will be really cool to put, like, different Harry Potter stickers and stuff on it, and I love it. It's, like, the perfect size. So they stuff in the suitcase. A chocolate frog. I thought that this was kind of a random gift, but I'm actually really excited to... Oh my god, it's milk chocolate with crisp rice. Rice Krispies. Uh, I'm gonna like this. It's, uh, you can collect like character cards. It's some Harry Potter candy. I'm very excited to try that and also collect the cards. I got another sweatshirt. Um, <laughs> this one is my, probably my favorite. It says, did someone say Draco Malfoy? I am Draco Malfoy obsessed. I am obsessed with his arc. Like I'm obsessed with Draco. His, like his plot line, I love it. Um, and I'm also obsessed with the way he looks, but I, um, I love his plot line, which is kind of like a weird thing to say, but I do. And I love Draco. So like every other girl on TikTok, but mine's like more of like the way they portray him in the books and the movies more than just like his looks. So 
no one's gonna believe me for that. They're just gonna be like, you're a bandwagon girl. But Draco isn't my favorite character. Just letting you know. You would know that if you watched my Who Knows Me Best video. I'll put it in my card. I think it's up here. It's up here. Click it. Now is the gifts from my parents. The first thing that I actually opened was this. This was on my wish list. Me and my sister actually both got one of these. This is an Echo Dot, and I'm pretty excited about it because I actually didn't know that you could sync your Echo, Echo Dot up to um, Apple Music, so I'm very excited. I'm really hoping it works with my lamp light bulb, but we shall see. And then I also got a smart, smart plug, so hopefully I can like connect it to my lamp. So this gift was kind of like, I had mentioned it once and I actually like needed it. So this is from Vera Bradley and I'm not a super big Vera Bradley person. I have a dance bag from there and a lanyard, that's pretty much it. But this is like a toiletry bag. It's like lined in the middle, I mean in the inside. And yeah, this is hold like full size stuff, which is kind of like my issue was I couldn't put like full size stuff into like toiletry bags. So I'm very excited about this. So then, I asked for this necklace. Um, this is like, it comes with like a pendant and then a chain. So this is from Lisa Leonard Designs. This is the little um, pendant. I don't know if you guys can see, but it's a little heart, tiny heart with a K. And then this is the, it just came with a chain. Um, yeah, I wanted some silver necklaces and I thought this one was really cute. So I got Beats, I think for Christmas, um, like four years ago. It's been a long time. And one of the sides of my Beats doesn't work. And my sister's Beats, like they're, like we have used the heck out of them. So we got new ones. We each got a pair of Beats. And I'm really excited to have Beats again because my AirPods are nice, but sometimes on planes, I don't love them. Um, and these are matte white, which my other ones were bright blue. And I'm so excited to have a matte white pair, but these um i already know i love beats and i'm very thankful for these and yeah that just like was like a that was a good gift moment if you guys know what i mean now let's get into the archer and olive portion of this type of of this section of the video so i asked for three things from archer and olive they like literally there was a box it was like a box and it just had all this archer and olive stuff and i was very happy the dotted notebook i will be using this year as my bullet journal and it is the, I think this is A5, um, it's 60 page, 160 pages, it's 160 GSM, you guys, which is really thick paper. And it has this design on it, it's like this olive green color. I'm obsessed, and I'm so excited to use it. I have been watching so many Archer and Olive videos because I have been wanting this journal so bad, and my journal this year is going to be fire. Then I got two of the, like, notepads, so this is what they look like. I got the black dotted one, and I also got the craft paper one, which you guys, the craft paper one, I am very excited about. Um, yes, I will use the heck out of these. These will get so much use. I am so thankful for these. Last couple of presents, and then we're done. The next things are actually two things that I'm wearing. So first off, this jean jacket I got. This is actually from Brandy. The one that I wanted from PacSun was sold out for like months. But I actually really like this and I'm wearing it with this hoodie. Here's the jean jacket, not on. It is like super baggy and oversized, which is what I wanted. And then this is a plain white hoodie, but on the back, I don't know if you guys can tell what it says, but it says sister one. And my sister got one that says sister two. So we have like hoodies that correlate, which we, my sister asked for those. So I'm very, very thankful for everything. Thank you so much to anyone who got me a gift. I love you all. I hope you guys all had a Merry Christmas. I know this video is kind of coming out late, but again, I am traveling in the middle of filming this video. Um, if you guys have any videos you guys want to see in the new year, let me know. Thank God 2020 is ending. I think this will be my last video of the year. So thank you guys for an amazing three, four months of my YouTube channel. This has been a big leap for me and I am very thankful that everyone has been super supportive. I love you guys and I will see you guys in 2021.